From players that performed like superhumans to Arsenal's coach betting on Mesut Ezio, here are some of the biggest scandals in Arsenal's history. Knighton's Magical Pills The Gunners were formed in 1886 and the first scandal involving the club can be traced back to the management days of Leslie Knighton in the 1924-25 season. Knighton was never the most popular manager at the club, while he was also alleged to have given his players some little silver pills, prescribed by a Harley Street doctor for their FA Cup first round game with West Ham. After taking the pills, it was claimed that the players performed like superhumans. While this is now obviously heavily regulated in every sport, it wasn't the case 100 years ago, when football clubs used all kinds of different tricks to win games. George Graham's Illegal Payments the early 1990s were a time when English football was plagued by bungie allegations and rumors of match fixing. Arsenal manager George Graham found himself dragged into the controversy when it was first discovered that he had accepted an illegal payment of £425,000 from notorious Norwegian football agent Rune Hogg in 1992 when Arsenal had signed two of his clients in John Jensen and Paul Ederson. Graham was eventually sacked in the February of the 1994-95 season and banned from club management for a year by the FA. As an Arsenal manager, Graham won numerous honors with the club between 1987 and 1995, including two league titles, FA Cup, two Football League Cups, as well as the 1994 European Cup Winners' Cup. Pizzagate The infamous battle of the buffet came at a time when relations between Arsenal and title rivals Manchester United were at an all-time low. After an infamous game at Old Trafford on 24 October 2004 that saw United prevail as two new winners, it all kicked off in the tunnel between players and staff of both teams. The highlight of the incident being the allegation that Arsenal Cesc Fabregas threw a slice of pizza at United manager Sir Alex Ferguson. In an interview with ITV Sports in 2022, Cesc Fabregas finally told the truth behind the famous incident, as he admitted that he did throw a slice of pizza at Sir Alex Ferguson, but insisted he wasn't aiming for the Manchester United manager. Fabregas said he was furious after the game, as the result ended Arsenal's unbeaten league run of 49 games, but insisted he had no intentions of getting involved in a fight in the tunnel. And finally, Mark Arbour betting on Mesut Ezo transfer. Arsenal Academy coach Mark Arbour had the book thrown at him when it was revealed he had used insider knowledge to win money on a bet relating to Mesut Ezio signing for the Gunners. Ezio signed for Arsene Wenger's side for £40 million on transfer deadline day in 2013. And soon after that, Arbour posted on Twitter that he had a lovely bet on Mesut Ezio. Arbour's father, Bob, was an Arsenal scout and it was alleged that Arbour had used inside information to place a bet on Ozil joining the club. The tweet came at a time when the relationship between football professionals and online sports betting was under huge scrutiny, despite the rising popularity of online betting as well as sports gambling. FA regulations stated that players and staff were not allowed to bet on games or markets relating to the professional game, but they decided not to charge Arbor over his conduct. However, Arsenal showed zero tolerance and made the decision to part company with Arbor given the evidence at hand. So what are your thoughts? Were there any other big scandals that I missed? Write down in the comments. Thank you all for watching, thank you for joining in, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more daily content.